My name is Charlie Taylor. I'm a senior coach at Career Protocol, and today I'm gonna to talk about Haas Berkeley. I love Berkeley because, as you would expect, it completely breaks the mold and it wants you to as well. They're really excited to see students and to find candidates who are willing to go beyond bounds. And in their teeny tiny class, you can imagine that you have a class, full, you have a small class full of people who are breaking borders all of the time. It's a really exciting and innovative place to be. One of the really awesome things about Haas Berkeley is they have really well-defined leadership principles, four to be exact. And when you're creating your application, think really deeply about how these have applied to you in your life. And also, it's really useful to show that you know the school and how you would take advantage of opportunities at Berkeley to be able to even dive deeper and develop these amazing uh, characteristics yourself. So we're talking about your ability to question the status quo, to think outside the box, to find solutions that maybe no one else has seen before. Confidence without attitude. What is your leadership style? Are you able to bring everybody to the table to really help people like share their diverse ideas to create uh, an environment where people can question the status quo? That is like the best form of leadership and something they're really excited to learn more about um, in your own particular style. Students always, we're curious, lifelong learners. Do you demonstrate that level of curiosity? Do you always know that like you're approaching things with a beginner's mind? And are you really excited just to see what else is out there? Because that means constant growth. And it also goes back and ties together really beautiful, beautifully with the confident humility of leaders without attitude. And it is really so much about being able to have confidence when you're in that learning mindset all of the time. And then of course, to be beyond ourselves. So they want to know that you are keyed in to the bigger world, that you know that you are a part of an environment and an ecosystem and that you give back and that you are um, and that and that you kind of see your place in that and how you want to lean into whatever community you're into. So when you're creating your applications, think about how can you show these very diverse elements. It's also a really wonderful way to determine whether or not Berkeley is actually a really good fit for you. Because if these core values don't match with your own core values, you might want to think about another school. But if they do, this school is amazing and they are really beautiful and powerful core values. So think a little bit about what you've done in your life to demonstrate these things, what you bring to the table in terms of these lovely qualities, and really critically, as you're working through your application, pay attention to what the school offers that can support you in your journey to developing these qualities and be prepared to talk about these things. This is a really important cornerstone of your Haas school due diligence. When you're having conversations with people about the school, you can use this as sort of a basis of the conversation and talk about like how you would wanna take advantage of various things to be able to develop some of these qualities. Um, but this is like a really, really beautiful talking point for Haas for you. The second thing really, and this is something that is really dear to my heart, it is all of the international opportunities that Haas offers. So Haas believes, and this is also a part of like going beyond yourself, um, that we are a part of a global community and how each and every student can impact that global community is really phenomenal. Haas boasts something like representation from 40 different countries. So you're gonna have colleagues in this tiny, tiny class from all over the world. They give you really incredible international study opportunities, whether that's in London, to the LSE, or in Spain, um, or, um, or in China even. Um, so you can really take advantage of the possibilities and the opportunities to be able to study abroad and add a semester of international experience. You can also add an MA in your global study, in global studies, topping off your MBA program so that you can learn even more and have a bigger diverse perspective. And then there are two really fantastic opportunities 
the uh, international business development and the global network. So many, many wonderful things to take advantage of in this rich, diverse, international culture. So if you're internationally minded, definitely take a look at Haas. And now let's talk a little bit more about Haas culture, which is really, really critical. So as you're doing your due diligence, one of the things that's going to be so important to Haas is knowing that you really understand what their culture is about, what their core values are about, and how you'll fit, and why that culture is so attractive to you. Haas is a small school. It boasts like something around 250 students. And it is, um, and it's again a very diverse class. And so you can imagine that when the adcom is crafting that class, that really small class, they want to choose people who are really going to bring some very interesting perspectives to the table. You definitely want to be able to show how you fit within a community, how you lean into a community, and how community is really important to you. So that Haas community is something that is really critical really beautiful component of the whole Haas experience. If you are applying to Haas, you must have a big heart, an innovative mind, and a real will to um, want to do something great and bold and big in the world. And I hope you go and do that on behalf of all of us at Career Protocol. Go forth and conquer and love your Haas application. Okay, that was lame. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you looking at the camera or somewhere else? I, I don't know. Where should I be? Oh, God, the camera. Should I look yeah. at Oh, I'm looking at the yeah. monitor. Can, yeah. yeah. Sorry, Johnny. Oh, I should be looking at the fish, huh? You can look at the fish if you want as well. All right. I'll look at the fish.